Hey guys, what's going on? And as always, a shout out to my friends of Bill. How's everyone doing today? Hopefully, you're having a beautiful day, a good day. And if not, you know what I always say, keep it in the moment. All right. Uh, you know, I got to give you the thought for today because this is my commitment and this is my service to you and myself. Uh, it's beautiful out. These are probably like the last few days we're going to have before... The cold starts coming in little by little. All right, October 15th reads, Am I deeply grateful to AA for what it has done for me in regaining my sobriety and opening up an entire, entirely new life for me? AA has made it possible for me to carry on other interests in business and in various other associations with people. It has made a full life possible for me. It would perhaps be wrong if all my activities were limited to AA work. It has made a well-rounded life possible for me in work, in play, and in hobbies of various kinds. But will I desert AA because of this? Will I accept a diploma and become a graduate of AA? Then they ask you, do I realize that I could have nothing worthwhile without AA? Oh, you guys already know this. I can't stress it enough. My life has changed so much because of this, because of this powerful fellowship. So why? Why would I... Why would I stop going to AA? Well, I haven't, like you already know, I haven't been going to the meetings. Why, let me re correct what I'm saying. Why would I stop living my life without AA? AA is always going to be a part of my life. It's the only reason, like they said in that, in the in the door for today, it's the reason I got all these things happening in my life. So why? Why would I take AA out of my life and think that I could graduate to other other things? No, you gotta, you gotta, I gotta keep humble. I gotta. I can't lose, I can't forget that once you start getting too comfortable, that's when this disease comes out of nowhere and bites you in the ass. And I know that, I know that, I've seen it so many times happen before, so why would I take that chance? I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't take that chance. It's, uh scary when I think about it so I would definitely not go there I just uh, take it one day at a time continue what I'm doing continue doing what I did what I've been doing all these years and that's basically it stay away from people places and things and the rest all falls into place because of this powerful fellowship so there's no way in hell that I would stop my uh, AA life. I got to go back to meetings. I do. I miss the meetings. I miss being around the people. I miss seeing the newcomers come in. Who knows? Maybe I'll go to a meeting tonight. Maybe I'll find a meeting tonight and uh, go, go check it out. It's been a little while, so... That's basically it. And, uh, yes. Where would I be? Where would I be? <laughs> Definitely not in a good place. I know where I'm gonna be if, and where I'm gonna continue to be if I continue to do what I'm doing. So, that's basically it. Guys, thank you guys for keeping me sober another day. Thank you guys for letting me share that. God willing. I'll see you guys tomorrow. God bless. Have a...
Have a great day. See ya.